Oh, good evening and welcome to the post-mortem from Sha Tin today. Um, as you're all probably well aware by now, uh, we didn't uh, participate. And as it turned out, it was the right move. Uh, the six up jackpotted, not that we could have played it anyway um, because of the unrace situation, but um, full jackpot to next Wednesday, which is what we were hoping for. At least something as jackpot is forward. Uh, so I'm just going to go quickly through the races and um, race one, Young Happy's uh, got the money. Uh, it was a decent run, defied the bias. There was a massive uh, on-speed bias today. Uh, not many were making ground. This was one of the few to come from the back of the field and win. Cosmo One was a decent run. Archer's Bow ran on strongly. Probably the unlucky runner was General Danroad. It was bolting coming to the turn. Had nowhere to go and found a gap late and ran on okay. Um, but a typical class five, not much depth there. Maybe the winner now that it's 1-1 uh, one, one can go on. Race two. Uh, the one that I thought because of the barrier draw would win, idyllic wind, did exactly as expected, sat just behind the speed and pushed out coming around the corner and was too strong. Uh, money win wins, uh, got too far back and was running on late. Telecom top star, this is getting very, very close to a win now. Um, the track bias absolutely gave it no hope. Um, we'll wait for it. Uh, probably on the all weather, and uh, it'll, with a bit of luck, it might pinch one before the season's end. Of the rest, I wouldn't be following any of them. They're no good. Race three, uh, Dragon Pins improved at its second run for uh, the new trainer Gibson, and uh, was pretty impressive. Sweet corner battled on uh, King Harada Sun. Um, this one settled well back and was running on. The favourite was red hot. Uh, drifted from 220 out to 320, tailed off at the 400, couldn't even keep up and come flying home, beaten about two lengths. It was a disgraceful ride. I don't know whether something happened to it early. There was nothing there. I, I didn't pick anything up. I think it just, just wouldn't go early. Um, so forget the run. You can guarantee it'll start nice and short next day. Uh, obviously, races four and five unraced, no interest there. Race six. Apollo uh, Cavalier, uh, this was aided by the massive on-speed bias, jumped at the front, uh, stacked them up in the middle stages and closed breaking 23 and they couldn't run it down. Boy, oh boy, was a good run. It got shuffled back coming to the turn and come flying home late. Speedy Gonzalez, the usual nonsense from it, gets back and runs on. It's a suck horse. Um, of the rest, uh, there was a bit of money at long odds for Dashing Fortune today. Uh, it was a better run. I think this one may be getting close and forever ahead. It got too far back and come flying home late. Just missed. It was a good run. Of the rest, I wouldn't be following too many of these until the season finishes. Race seven. Uh, this was impressive. First start in Hong Kong. Able friend. Sat on the speed. Uh, kicked away at about the 300. It was all over. Beat them easy. Master Sommelier got back, ran on strongly, but was never, ever threatening the winner, but beat the rest out of sight. My name is Bond. This one, uh, we touted this one, and uh, it ran third at a massive price. Happy Valley's its go. This was the, this was the warm-up run. And the first starter in Hong Kong, uh, Smart Ball, come from nearly last. Uh, was a very, very good run. Uh, we might be following this. The favourite multi-victory. Never, ever gave a yelp. Never looked like it. Um, may have had enough now, so we'll be keeping an eye out for it. I think it's going to be a risk. Race eight. Um, Supreme Genki, another one on speed. The, the first four around the corner ran one, two, three, four. Um, so nothing was able to make any ground. Uh, great champ. Loom, the great charm loomed up at the 250. Looked like it was going to win. Wouldn't go on with it. Exciting dream. It's probably had enough for this season. Put it away, bring it back in September, October. It'll win a race. Of the rest, Santa Fe Sun was a nice run. Nearly last coming around the corner and closed off pretty well. Not much to be said about the rest. Although uh, Fujian Spirit was an interesting one. Sat wide for the trip. Went wider coming around the corner. It was a bit of a slaughter ride. Um, wasn't a bad run. Uh, race nine. 
Again, the big favour on the speed. Lucky Forever went forward from the wide draw, sat outside the leader, kicked away at around the 300 and just kept grinding away. Lucky Omens railed up late. It ran well. Sunny Ying, uh, it went forward and took the lead mid-race and uh, fought on strongly. Enthusiasm was a big run. It was last at the 400 and come flying home along with Towering, towering Storm. Another suck run from it. Uh, unfortunately, that's the sort of horse it is. It's always going to be running on and it's always going to trap you into going for it. Uh, classic jewellery, wait till it goes to Happy Valley for it. This was the dead run of the rest. Travel band, the favourite, was never ever travelling any good. Got a nice shit mixer at the top of the straight to make sure it had no hope. Forget the run, it'll improve next start. And the last race, uh, again, the on speed bias gave nothing a chance. Fion's Treasure just camped on the speed. Uh, they all shuffled off the fence coming around the corner. It railed up and uh, got the money. Uh, the second and third horses came from well back. Keen Wong Choi and Abel Speed, both good runs. Rumba King was a bit stiff. Um, it was travelling, coming to the corner on the rails and got shuffled back by the two dogs that were in front when they gave it away. And um, it was a pretty decent run. As was Tai Sing Yeah. Now, this was the warm-up run guaranteed. All its best forms at, uh, at Happy Valley. So this was just a warm-up. Uh, it'll be hitting there before the season's end. Um, as I said, next Wednesday, jackpot day. at uh, It's a day meeting at Sha Tin. It's a Hong Kong holiday. So we'll be having a good look at that. Hopefully, they'll let us play by not putting unraced in the scenario. I uh, hope you've had some joy over the weekend. Good luck with your punting. And uh, we'll see you in the next couple of days when I do the preview for uh, Wednesday. Thanks for tuning in.